Lakshadweep Hindi Laksadvipa, Laksadvip, Lakshadweep, formerly known as the Lakadiv, Minakoi, and Amanadivi Islands, is a group of islands in the Lakadiv Sea, 200 to 440 kilometers (120 to 270 miles) off the southwestern coast of India. The archipelago is a union territory and is governed by the Union Government of India. They were also known as Lakadiv Islands, although geographically this is only the name of the central subgroup of the group. Lakshadweep comes from Lakshadwipa, Laksadvipa which means 100,000 islands in Sanskrit. The islands form the smallest union territory of India and their total surface area is just 32 square kilometers 12 square miles. The lagoon area covers about 4200 square kilometers 1600 square miles. The territorial waters area 20000 square kilometers 7700 square miles and the exclusive economic zone area 400000 square kilometers 150000 square miles. The region forms a single Indian district with 10 subdivisions. Kavarati serves as the capital of the Union Territory and the region comes under the jurisdiction of Kerala High Court. The islands are the northernmost of the Lakshadweep Maldives Chagos group of islands, which are the tops of a vast undersea mountain range, the Chagos Lakative Ridge. As the islands have no Aboriginal inhabitants, scholars have suggested different histories for the settlement of these islands. Archaeological evidence supports the existence of human settlement in the region around 1500 BC. The islands have long been known to sailors, as indicated by an anonymous reference from the 1st century AD to the region in Periplus of the Erythrian Sea. The islands were also mentioned in the Buddhist Jataka stories of the 6th century BC. Islam was established in the region when Muslim missionaries arrived around the 7th century. During the medieval period, the region was ruled by the Chola dynasty and kingdom of Kananur. The Catholic Portuguese arrived around 1498 but were expelled by 1545. The region was then ruled by the Muslim House of Arakal, followed by Tipu Sultan. On his death in 1799, most of the region passed on to the British and with their departure, the Union Territory was formed in 1956. Ten of the islands are inhabited. At the 2011 Indian Census, the population of the Union Territory was 64,473. The majority of the indigenous population is Muslim and most of them belong to the Shafi school of the Sunni sect. The islanders are ethnically similar to the Malayali people of the nearest Indian state of Kerala. Most of the population speaks Malayalam with Mahi or Mal being the most spoken language in Minakoi Island. The islands are served by an airport on the Agati Island. The main occupation of the people is fishing and coconut cultivation, with tuna being the main item of export. History One of the earliest references to the region is by an anonymous author in the Periplus of the Erythrian Sea. There are references to the control of the islands by the Cheras in the Sangam Paduruppattu. Local traditions and legends attribute the first settlement on these islands to the period of Cheraman Perumal, the last Chera king of Kerala. The oldest inhabited islands in the group are Amani, Kalpeni Andrat, Kavarati, and Agati. Archaeological evidence suggests that Buddhism prevailed in the region during the 5th and 6th centuries AD. According to popular tradition, Islam was brought to Lakshadweep by an Arab named Ubaidullah in AD 661. His grave is located on the island of Andrat. During the 11th century, the islands came under the rule of the late Cholas and subsequently the Kingdom of Kananur. In the 16th century, the Portuguese ruled the seas between Ormuz and the Malabar coast and south to Ceylon. As early as 1498, they took control of the archipelago called Lakwadivas by them, later on to exploit coir production, until the islanders expelled them in 1545. In the 17th century, the islands came under the rule of Ali Rajas, Arakal Bivi of Kanur, who received them as a gift from the Kalatheris. The islands are also mentioned in great detail in the stories of the Arab traveller Ibn Battuta, the Amanadivi group of islands Androth, Amini, Kadmat, Kilton, Chetlith, and Bitra came under the rule of Tipu Sultan in 1787. They passed to British control after the Third Anglo-Mysore War and were attached to South Kanara. The rest of the islands came under the suzerainty of the Arakal family of Kananur in return for a payment of annual tribute. The British took over the administration of those islands for non-payment of arrears. These islands were attached to the Malabar district of the Madras Presidency during the British Raj. 
Independent India On 1 November 1956, during the reorganisation of Indian states, the Lakshadweep Islands were separated from Madras and organised into a separate Union territory for administrative purposes. The new territory was called Lakadiv, Minakoy, and Amindivi Islands before adopting the Lakshadweep name on 1 November 1973, to safeguard India's vital shipping lanes to the Middle East, and the growing relevance of the islands in security considerations. An Indian Navy base, INS Dweeprakshak, was commissioned on Kavarati Island. A D expedition by amateur radio operators was run on Agati Island during November 2013. Geography Lakshadweep is an archipelago of 12 atolls, 3 reefs and 5 submerged banks, with a total of about 39 islands and islets. The reefs are in fact also atolls, although mostly submerged, with only small unvegetated sand caves above the high water mark. The submerged banks are sunken atolls. Almost all the atolls have a northeast-southwest orientation with the islands lying on the eastern rim, and a mostly submerged reef on the western rim, enclosing a lagoon. It has 10 inhabited islands, 17 uninhabited islands, attached islets, 4 newly formed islets and 5 submerged reefs. The main islands are Kavarati, Agati, Minakoy, and Amini. The total population of the territory is 60,595 according to the 2001 census. Agati has an airport with direct flights from Kochi. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> India's coral islands. The Amanadevi subgroup of islands consisting of Amini, Kelton, Chetlet, Kadamit, Bitra, and Perumal Par and the Lakative subgroup of islands comprising mainly Androth, Kalpeni, Kavarati, Pitti, and Suheli Par, both subgroups having a submarine connection between them through Pitti Bank. Together with Minakoy Island, a lonely atoll located at the southern end of the 200 km broad 9 degree channel, they form the coral islands of India in the Arabian Sea. All these islands have been built up by corals and have fringing coral reefs very close to their shores. Two banks further north are not considered part of the group Angria Bank, Addis Bank. The atolls, reefs, and banks are listed from north to south in the table. Flora and fauna The Lakshadweep archipelago forms a terrestrial ecoregion together with the Maldives and the Chagos. It has over 600 species of marine fishes, 78 species of corals, 82 species of seaweed, 52 species of crabs, 2 species of lobsters, 48 species of gastropods, 12 species of bivalves, 101 species of birds. It is one of the four coral reef regions in India. The corals are a major attraction for the tourist. Pity Island, is an important breeding place for sea turtles and for a number of pelagic birds such as the brown knotty lesser crested tern and greater crested tern The island has been declared a bird sanctuary. Cetacean diversity off the Lakshadweep Islands and in adjacent areas is higher than other areas although a lack of scientific study results in poor understanding and conservation promoting. These include various whales e.g. pygmy blue, brides, sperm, smaller cetaceans e.g. orca, pilot whale and dolphins. The region does not have a rich flora and almost all the plants can be found on the mainland of India. There is also an absence of forest in the region. Nearly 400 species of flowering plants have been documented, including three species of sea grasses Simidocha isoetifolia, Syringodium isoetifolium, and Thalassia hemprici, other angiosperms as Pandanus, Heliotropium fortherianum, Tornforcia argentea, and Pemphis acidula, as well as fungi, algae, lichens are also found. The common flora of the coral sands include coconut groves and coastal shrubs as Pemphis acidula, Cordia subcordata, Sivala toccata, Thespesia populnia, Suriana maritima, Dodonea viscosa, Guitarda speciosa and seaweeds such as sea lettuces, Codium and Hypena. <laughs> Government and administration Lakshadweep forms a single Indian district and is governed by an administrator appointed by the President of India under Article 239 of the Constitution. The present administrator is Mr. Farooq Khan IPS. There are ten subdivisions of the territory. 
In Minicoy and Agati the subdivision is under a deputy collector while in the remaining eight islands developmental activities are coordinated by subdivisional officers. The Collector Cum Development Commissioner who is also the district magistrate oversees matters coming under district administration, such as revenue, land settlement, law and order. The district magistrate is assisted by one additional district magistrate and ten executive magistrates with respect to enforcement of law and order. Administrator in his capacity as Inspector General of Lakshadweep Police has command and control of the Lakshadweep Police. Administration Secretariat is in Kavarati. The Union Territory comes under the jurisdiction of the Kerala High Court at Kochi along with a system of lower courts. The territory elects one member to the Lok Sabha lower house of the Parliament of India. Demographics According to the 2011 census Lakshadweep has a population of 64,429, roughly equal in number to that of the Marshall Islands. This gives it a ranking of 627th among the 640 districts in India. The district has a population density of 2013 inhabitants per square kilometer, 5210 per square miles. Its population growth rate over the decade 2001 to 2011 was 6.23%. Lakshadweep has a sex ratio of 946 females for every 1,000 males, and a literacy rate of 92.28%. Most people of Lakshadweep are descendants of migrants from the Malabar coast of southwest India, and the islanders are ethnically similar to coastal Kerala's Malayali people. More than 93% of the indigenous population are Muslims, and the majority of them belong to the Shafi school of the Sunni sect. The southernmost and second largest island of Minicoy has an ethnically Mal's population that are native to the Maldives. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Religion. The inhabitants of Lakshadweep were known to practice different religious customs. Then Islam was propounded by the Sheikh Ubaidullah. The spread of Islam has contributed to the religious identity of Lakshadweep. Eid ul Fitr, Muharram, Eid ul Adha, and Malad un Nabi are the prominent occasions when the people of the island gather in various mosques. Religious observance in Lakshadweep is characterized by certain festivals that are found in its core ethnic groups. Molud is one such religious event when the islanders offer prayers to the divine power and eat in groups. The festival of Rathib is another uncommon occasion which originated in the Kavarati region of Lakshadweep. The grave of Sheikh Qasim, one of the respected saints is praised during Rathib by the people of the island to gather his holy blessings. The Sunni branch of Islam is the predominant faith. Topic languages The principal languages of Lakshadweep are Malayalam, Jessari and Mal. The people of all the northern islands speak a dialect of Malayalam with the influence of Tamil and Arabic similar to ARWI. The people of Minicoy, the southernmost atoll, speak Mal, a variant of Devehi language spoken in the Maldives. Malayalam with Malayalam script was introduced as the official language of Lakshadweep during the British Raj. Previously a type of Arabic script Arabi Malayalam was used for the language. The policy was continued by the Indian government. Malayalam serves as a link language on the islands including on the Mal-dominated Minicoy island. The dances here include, Lava Dance, Kolkali Dance and Parichakli Dance. Topic economy Lakshadweep's gross territorial domestic product for 2004 is estimated at $60 million at current prices. There is little economic inequality in Lakshadweep and the poverty index is low. Coconut fiber extraction and production of fiber products is Lakshadweep's main industry. There are five coir fiber factories, five production demonstration centers and seven fiber curling units run by the Government of India. These units produce coir fiber, coir yarn, curled fiber and corridor mattings. Topic Fisheries Lakshadweep comprises the only coral atolls of the country. With a vast lagoon of 4,200 square kilometers (1,600 square miles), it has territorial waters of 20,000 square kilometers (7,700 square miles), exclusive economic zone (EEZ) of 4 lakh (400,000 square kilometers (150,000 square miles), and coastal line of about 132 kilometers (82 miles). There is an estimation of about 1 lakh tons, 100,000 tons, 110,000 tons of tuna and tuna-like fishes and about an equal quantity of shark in the sea around Lakshadweep. Fishing is the main livelihood of the islanders. 
Freshly caught tuna is processed by drying it in the sun after cooking and smoking. The resultant product, known as moss, are popular products exported from these islands to Southeast Asian countries. Eleven workshops in islands and two boat building yards cater to the needs of fishermen. There are 375 boats in operation in Lakshadweep. Topic tourism Due to its isolation and scenic appeal, Lakshadweep was already known as a tourist attraction for Indians since 1974. This brings in significant revenue, which is likely to increase. Since such a small region cannot support industries, the government is actively promoting tourism as a means of income in Bangaram and Kadmat Islands. Bangaram is projected to become a major destination for international tourism. Marine fauna are plentiful. Water sports activities such as scuba diving, wind surfing, snorkeling, surfing, kayaking, canoeing, water skiing, sport fishing, yachting and night sea voyages are popular activities among tourists. Tourists flock to these islands throughout the year, except during the southwest monsoon months when seas are extremely rough. The government has also proposed to set up two customs clearance check-in offices so that tourists can enter directly instead of getting permission from the nearest customs office in Kochi, which is 260 nautical miles, 300 miles 480 kilometers from these islands. These will be the smallest customs offices in India. Tourism is expected to get a big boost after these offices open as the islands lie on one of the busiest cruise ways. Topic. Desalination A low-temperature thermal desalination plant opened on Kavarati in 2005, at a cost of 50 million rupees the experimental plant, which uses the temperature difference between warm surface seawater and much colder seawater at 500 meters depth to generate potable water as well as energy, was slated to produce 100,000 liters per day of potable water from seawater. Production costs in 2005 were 220 rupees minus 250 per cubic meters, 4 euros and 10 cents minus 4.6 per cubic meters. The cost was supposed to drop to 30 rupees minus 60 per cubic meters, 55 cents minus 1.11 per cubic meters with increased capacity. The technology was developed by the National Institute of Ocean Technology. It can be used to produce drinking water and also for power generation and air conditioning. In addition, the deep seawater contains extra nutrients for fish, an important source of food and income for the local population. The government plans to set up desalination plants with a capacity of 10 million litres, per day on all islands and coastal areas. In 2009, the NIOT announced plans to build plants on Minicoy, Agati and Andrit. <laughs> Transport and tourism Agati Aerodrome on Agati Island is the only airport in Lakshadweep. Alliance Air, a subsidiary of the state-owned carrier, serves Agati and flies to Kochi and Bengaluru on the mainland. Kingfisher Airlines, had flights connecting Kochi and Bangalore to Agati before the airline ceased operations. The other islands are linked by the Pawan Hans helicopter or boat service. Six ships connect Kochi, Calicut Baypur, and Lakshadweep, MV Kavarati, MV Amindivi, MV Minakoy, MV Arabian Sea, MV Lakshadweep Sea and MV Bharat Sima. Tourists need a permit to visit the islands. Foreign nationals are not permitted to visit certain islands. According to the current alcohol laws of India, alcoholic beverage consumption is not permitted in the Lakshadweep archipelago except on Bangaram Island. Topic. See also Lakshadweep Lok Sabha constituency Lakshadweep police Coral reefs in India Topic References Topic Further reading RC Majumdar, The History of Ancient Lakshadweep, Calcutta, 1979 External links Lakshadweep Travel Guide from Wikivoyage